Okay, so let's talk about how we can determine where the steepest slope is using a topographic map. Here's a fairly complicated topographic map, and let's take a look at it real quick. We have several index contours. You can see I have two 200 index contours and one 300 index contour. We have a river flowing into the ocean. We have what looks like railroad tracks, and two points X and Y. Now, a common question on the Regents exam would be, where is the most steep slope on this map, and how do you know? Well, if you take a look at where the lines are really close packed, closely packed together, like in this area up here near the top of the map, we would know that this has to have the steepest slope. Because what that means is that over a very short distance, there's a very substantial change in elevation. And a big change in elevation over a short distance means a very steep slope. So we know that the steepest slope is here because the contour lines are tightly packed together. On the other hand, occasionally we'll see a question about where there's the flattest slope. Well, of course, the opposite would be true. The flattest area would be found where the lines are farthest apart. So on this map, probably somewhere in this bottom left area. So just to recap, the steepest slope will be found where the lines are close together. And that is because there's a big change in elevation over a short distance. The flattest slope would be found where the lines are very widely spaced. Thank you.